I'm getting good at catching the orb like that. So, yeah, it's something I didn't mention that you can see for yourselves here. Once you hit, uh, once you get to the second castle. Second version of whatever. Once you get to the... Yeah, once you unlock the second castle. However you want to phrase it. And I'm doing a very poor job of doing so. You might notice that there's enemies, level 2 enemies. Well... It's tempting. Do I even know what this does yet? That, uh... That hangs around for a while, doesn't it? There it goes. <laughs> This is a good... Cleared it out? Yeah. So, this is a reference to Gradius. Oh, yeah. Level 2 enemies, blah blah blah. They're stronger. No big deal. Anyway, this is a reference to Gradius. Except that instead of just blocking projectiles, it actually does damage to enemies. And I might add, it does a lot of damage to enemies. I don't know what this thing is, but it scares me. I don't think I want to go that way yet. Also, you can also... I thought there was a way to put it behind you. I guess not. How did that not hit me? That doesn't make any sense at all. You can also abuse this a bit, because the shield doesn't decrease until it's, you know, right there. So that's fun. Look at that damage. That's stupid, that's stupid amount of damage. I just got a helmet. large meat. No, no, not a turkey. A large meat. Huh. Aren't you glad you did that now? So yeah, I completely forgot the aqueduct loops back around here, which is great. And now we get these things. They're not red skeletons, they're not blood skeletons. They are skeleton liquid. And because they're liquid, I'm pretty sure they're vulnerable to uh, electricity. So that Yellowstone that I've pretty much permanently equipped. Ew. Forgot all about the melty zombies. What do you do, anyway? I guess we'll never find out. 
I swear there was a way to... That's definitely not the way. Yeah, unfortunately, once you get this, there's... <laughs> once you get the Bible combined with the Lightning Book, there's really no reason to ever switch. Another helmet. Hadouken? Well, melty zombies multiply. I didn't know that. Now we already know what that one does. So now I just gotta wait for my MP to regenerate. Okay. Save point right up here. Shieldo. Yeah, I might have saved. No, tempting to see what that would do, but oh, hi. So there are fishies down here. There's my dagger. Question is, do I want to use the dagger? Continue, you know. I sort of want to stick with this broken combination for a bit. Because believe me, it's broken. I think that was just a regular potion. I still have a bit of shield left, huh? Alright. We'll never find out what the cross does. Is that a sack of four hundred dollars? Uh, yeah, four hundred dollars. Also, I was about to question how I have full health, but I just picked up a life pot, so duh. All right, what do you do? Well, guess what? <laughs> Okay, that's kind of cool. But how much damage do they do? Not an impressive amount. Got a couple free potions out of it, though. So, you're just kind of there, huh? Alright. I'm sorry, what was that? Can, can I get a replay on that? That's not what you did last time, is it? Oh, 
Oh, it's like a step mine. Step mine. Why did I say that? I say some very silly things sometimes. And then, of course, there's the Gatling gun, but who cares? I know, I was like... When I introduced that, I was like, Oh, it's so amazing! It's a wonderful weapon! Now I'm like, eh. Who cares? Don't impress me much. Oh, excellent. This is a great way to conserve hearts, to be, to be honest. It's a really good equalizer, too, I might add. Like, if the game's too tough, you just put this thing on and off and away you go. Or if an enemy's just being particularly pesky. As that one was. I think hitting candles... Okay, yeah, hitting anything makes that go away. So this is how the crushing stone works. Well, bam I got an Earth Ring. If I remember correctly, Earth Ring. Nah, I don't remember correctly. The Bible. Let's see what that looks like. Not really impressive? Hold on. Okay, very impressive. So, yeah, I go in here and I shouldn't be able to get out. This is a place for later. The save point is up there. Yeah, I shouldn't have saved down here. That's okay, though. Still kind of a shortcut. So right and down and around. Ah. See, you can't use both. I thought you could use the sub-weapon while the item crash was going on. Magic crash? Magic spell? Whatever you want to call it. Well, well, well. What do we have here? It's... A mantle made of velvet. Okay. Yeah, these skeleton mirrors are about as tough as the skeleton soldiers were back when I started the game. Okay. Apparently, ramps confuse them. Well, I was trying to get multiple of them on screen, but 
don't seem to want to cooperate. Oh well. Anyway, what was I saying about progression? Did I ever figure out what this does? Sonda! Yeah, I don't think I actually used that last time. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, here we go. Dracula's heart. I hold the key to Dracula's heart. One of Dracula's bodily remains has the power to negate petrification. Nice. I will happily take that. Okay. Before we, you know, do progression. Okay, cool. I want to find out where the, uh, I want to find out what's up here. Now, where was up here? Up here. Yeah. Hold on, let me... I want to check this room first. Because I don't seem to have it on either map. Oh. Oh. No, this isn't where I want to be right this minute. Sword level three, though, huh? I don't like the fact that the shields hurt me. They're shields. They're not supposed to do that. And in case you're wondering, I just want to fight this the jet one time. All right. I'm all beat up now. Continue to be beat up, apparently, as I collect more furniture. How's my furniture look, anyway? I've got... I have more than I... Um... More than half? Okay, less than half, but... We're getting there. Things are annoying. Alrighty. Real save. Wish there was something I could hop off there. Oh yeah, I should actually show off what kind of damage this thing can do. It does a lot. It does a lot of damage. 
I think there's a cab. We'll find out. Oh, and you can keep charging it while you jump kick things. But I just want to see if it increases just marginally the long. Thanks! Thanks, critical hit! I don't know how to do basic math. I don't think it did. Yeah, it's... it's... there's, there's a cap. Also, I suddenly realize why I feel like I'm doing less damage to those enemies. It's because I am. Because I have the Crush Stone equipped instead of the Yellow Stone. Duh. Okay, I give up. Where are the enemies? Where are they all hide? Did they hear I was coming? And... Did y'all see that? A boogeyman? There was a boogeyman. There you are. I'm not crazy. Also, why was it thundering in just that one room, I wonder? Ancient armor? What are we talking about, ancient armor? Legacy... Legend hat. Legacy? It looks like a Kill Bill suit. Legend has it that this armor was worn by ancient gods. It drops my intelligence, which means my thunder spell wouldn't work as well. But it increases my defense. Tons. I'll go with the defense for now. Seeing as I'm not exactly using the Bible. As a matter of fact, I'll go back to the Yellowstone for now. It won't help with the specters, but it'll help with other enemies that, I'm, that really annoy me. Come on, I hit you. And you hit me too, and I didn't like it. Ah, no! Oh, there's a platform there, never mind. I thought I needed to bounce off the specter. Those enemies are only annoying if you're stupid about it like I am. It's still sealed. Well, that didn't work. What? Please stop. Have mercy. I'm just a simple vampire hunter. Corner's way over here. Oh, there's a hint card, though. And a life pot that I can't get because I was stupid. Hint card six. The red book and the knife share a secret. Oh, that. Oh, that. Oh, that. Oh, that. Oh, that. Yeah. There was some speculation about what that means. Like, there's some secret technique that you can do. Come on, now. If you're using the Book of Fire and the knife, there's some secret technique you can do. Apparently, allegedly, however you want to phrase it. Spectre, come here. I need your help. Hello?
Well, that didn't work. I'm just getting my butt handed to me. I need an emergency potion. That, that was the opportunity. Both of those were the opportunity I was looking for. What is that hitbox? That's stupid! As am I. Oh my god. Seriously, that's hit that hitbox. Ah. Wait, I haven't been up here in the other castle? Really? Why not? Was there reason was there a reason I couldn't? Huh, alright. Wrong button. Double check here. Yeah, we're done here. So the other thing about my headphones is they hurt my ears after a while. I don't like that. But I'm too cheap to actually go buy like a $50 pair of Logitech, so, you know, you get what you pay for. I'm paying for an earache. <laughs> But in all seriousness, these are really good headphones. Just, just a couple little problems with them as well. You know what? I should progress the plot. I should progress the plot because... I'm gonna be coming back here anyway. As in, like, I need to come back here anyway, so... Alrighty. Oh, Maxim. I see you are still alive. Oh, Maxim? No. Oh, I see you are still alive. That's like my death voice. Oh, I see you are still alive. I don't know. Whatever. Maxim. No. You're not Maxim. Ha! You're on to me. What the hell are you? I am... myself. It is not the me that you knew in the past. This man's suppressed desires, coupled with his possession of Dracula's remains, gave rise to a separate spirit. And... that other spirit is me. I'm not sure if he's even aware of my existence. And it was you who kidnapped Liddy? Hehe. Hehe. Ha ha. Ho ho. Of course it was my doing. She belongs to me. But he went and lost his memory and doesn't even know where she is. But he will retrieve his memory soon. When he does, she'll be all mine. Damn you! Sure about that? If I die, your best friend will perish with me. Ah! Your death is at hand. Die, you vile dog! No, you. Oh my God! That wasn't supposed to happen. I absolutely destroyed that boss. I'm sorry. <laughs>